in on my left, be your right Hurtling in like a meteorite See when we bring in the hype, it's unbelievable Even the video rights I am the sauce, I'm gonna be my boss What's so bad it hurts, but honestly it could be worse Jungle Beats, we fuck chickens, goodbye Sorry? <laughs> Can I look at that hand of yours? Sorry? Can I look at that hand of yours? No, you can't, that'll cost you, you better, you better hop on our Patreon if you want that <laughs> I want it if you want a hand job from Sandy, make sure you're on our Patreon. <laughs> uh, we're here today you. to review an unknown artist. Um... What's his name? <laughs> What's his <laughs> name? You've got the fucking email. <laughs> <laughs> hala, 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 hala. We are. We do the best reviews in the country, representing Melbourne, Australia, but also the, the world. world. Here's the problem: all these fucking uh, reaction <laughs> review channels, right? They don't support. Unknown artists, well, not many of them do. We're out here not mm -hmm. just getting the mainstream, but we're getting the smaller artists. But of course, we started off doing this for free, doing just yeah, fucking yeah, doing yeah. it. And now people have supported us on Patreon because so many people ask us. Mm -hmm. So now we have this service. That's one thing. If you notice other channels, they will only, like, say the, the Sean's and everyone else, they will do only really the bigger artists. But we, we do everything. We, we do suck the dicks of everybody. Exactly. We suck the dicks of the mainstream, but also Australia and also the unknowns. We want to cater towards it all. We suck all a lot the dicks, of dicks. All the colors, now, we have, all the sizes. We have so much dick in our fucking bodies that we don't need to eat because we just live off seed. And <laughs> uh, you know what? I could see you thinking of where the punchline would go and you're already laughing. <laughs> like this. I, could... I was just imagining it's just like with dicks in our ears and fucking armpits with holes and uh, just semen just coming out of them. Uh, sorry. Um, <laughs> Hopefully this hasn't warded off the whole population of viewers. So we have a Patreon uh, called Uzaihu. Uzai uh, I tried to pronounce it for Not me. gonna guess where you're from. No, 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 I know where he's from. I'll just I'll say it. Uh Uzaya. Uzaya. Alright. Um so he's from this young man is from Davenport, Iowa. My friend, I'm going Whoa. up. Where are you going? <laughs> Going back to America, and I'm actually going to Iowa for a couple of days, so um, hit me up if you got any spots to go to. Otherwise, we got three tracks from his latest EP. We're going to review them right now. Hell yeah. Boy. Ready? Nah, man. It's called Reverse, produced by Rob Kelly. Gotta play it, Uzi, in reverse. Thank you, bro. It's been a minute since. It's just been a minute, man. <laughs> if you've watched our Unknown Artist series, it's been a minute. You know, I got vibes of like a Big Sean Amine hybrid right here. Mm, I didn't get too many Big Sean vibes besides maybe the nasaliness, but I got huge Amine vibes and I also got, got, got slight Charles Gambino vibes as well. For sure. Uh, straight up, production, amazing. I love the uh, the warped keys, the the background. Dun, 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 dun. Like it had, it was just beautiful. I'm trying to think what it reminded me of, but just straight up production, absolutely beautiful. Right, right in my avenue straight away. Absolutely agreed. And then your flow was come on and dumb on the really this. enjoyable. Come on, come on like that. The content of your lyrics, I didn't pay too much attention to, but it clearly wasn't. Based on a, 
It was more than the superficial, it seemed like. We're mm. not talking about fucking money or sex or women here. We're yeah. talking about something that seems like it has a bit of meaning to you. Overall, just an enjoyable track, and I'm, I'm pleased to... I love your tone. Your tone of voice is what drew me in, right? I feel like it's, it's different enough where it could stand in its own lane, but it's kind of similar-ish when you mm. compare it to others. I, I like your tone as well, but I would have liked a bit of a switch up. Okay. I mean, don't get me wrong. That's a track, good critique. This track is really good, but like the whole track was kind of like the same tone the whole way through. Even when you did like the extra voice layering on the, on the final sort of hook or bridge, I just feel like that you could have like maybe used a voice pitch up or maybe voice layering at certain points. I just feel like that little bit of extra creativity with your vocals on here would mean that when you do rap with that lower, that lower effort, it shines more brightly because it's a bit more diversity. That's such a great point you just made. So take that. That's the only critique, really. Besides, like that's that's the only thing that I found that was a little monotonous. Other than that, tracks fire. I fuck with it. Park featuring Soul True. Just turn it all the way down. Oh Soul, put me up with that senior citizen discount. Spring chicken with a few old blue habits. Lifestyle supports got me doing gymnastics, doing fantastic till I bust my ass trying to dismount. Brush it off, take a bow, show you early whites. Go out and go to sleep, call it an early night Fool around, you go around in those songs with the boat Fade, you feeling out of my sails I was in a hurry, it's in the morning, you were born You trying to play it, just a jury, but Do your thing, say you ain't all the same We all going through it, what a shame, what a shame, man yeah. So when I start, I fell off the mark I wanted to part myself Four days before I made meals down in your top run Who gon' help you out when you want in that rock bottom? SOS, scattered brain, then come flip it. If I got a lot of baggage, will you come? Because I'm scared of falling in love. Is it wrong that I want me all in love? But I'm climbing a tall ladder, I got liquid and gas, too. I'm solid, in my solace, this is what matters. Chase the wrong things and you get used to the pursuit. Last with the people, a life full of water, coulda, shoulda, that's a pretty painful punishment. All said and done, beat me back to the mother shit. So go ahead, bro, you better speak how you feel. Not complicated, they got me made. Even better, man. Even more enjoyable for me. Super smooth. I loved how you pitched the vocals and you had a bit more... He sung on that track, right? He had a combination. Mm -hmm. A really soulful feature that was really subtle in the background. Extremely enjoyable production. I love that. Yeah. Production was really beautiful. The the keys are sort of built up like the... Dun, dun. Dun. Just had that real. Don't you, don't you love when he? I love when when he mimics it. music. It just he's a beautiful instrument. It just it just he? had a really light-hearted approach to it. <laughs> it was super light-hearted. Just had a real feel goodness to it, but still had like a, sli a slight sadness to it. Um, you you mentioned like when he sings a bit in the hook there. I feel like that the 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 backing vocals were so beautiful that I would have rather him shine in the hook more. I feel like um, wait, wait, hold on. the backing vocals were so beautiful. You'd rather him shine in the hook more. Like the, the like the feature, the feature. Oh, the feature. Hook I wanted I wanted the feature more on the hook because the feature was more in the background. Like he sung a bit on the hook, but it kind of sounded still very similar toned. Like it kind of took it. A, I thought I would have liked to hear more more of the the beautiful feature on the hook, like ju just him, and maybe your backing maybe your backing singing more quieter. Like your vocals were so loud that you could barely hear the feature on the hook, and I think that reversing that would have made this track a bit more uh, versatile. Like. Once again, your flow is really, really fucking nice. Like that, that, that real low, hazy, Amine style is good, but there's still not really much switch up. I, I would love to hear just a bit more, just more switch up, more diversity with your flows on these tracks. But of course, this is early. And besides that, everything is still really enjoyable. And you can see that's a bit of personal preference differences between, I think definitely what you said had merit. And um, it'd be interesting to hear the difference. Mm. Like maybe you want to be the center of attention of your music, which is why you want to shine more than... The things around you but sometimes i feel like that's a way to just bring still more focus to you i know that's just how i feel that's just how i feel and down that matters fuck your man yes. bitch produced by blue magic who produced the previous track i know the sample uh. i spit uh. literature and i'm so proficient no hook still really man ain't no need to go fishing Fair fight. If you say I'm the shit, then you will be very right. 
harder to follow cause I'm all skill Stop the swallow, that's a hard pill Take your medicine, got bright ideas, feel like Edison Let me put it like first day first on black mail Maybe that's why I rap well They was on the way, man on my left, be your right Hurtling it like a media right See when we bring in the hype, it's unbelievable Even the media rights, I need to go famous Send them straight back to the stone age I give a hundred and ten percent And if I do what I meant, what I said Be like, make your marks on the sharp You cannot erase me Do these niggas take patience But these niggas so hasty So they all can play impossible Couldn't say that it was off Clearly the most versatile track right there. In terms of production. Even flows. You don't think he switched up his flow? He did. Many times. But and did he switch up his tone? Hmm. Interesting question. He switched up his flows, but did he switch up his tone? Now I got him off with the clip of my rap. Deal with the canvas, let me know. And if I do what I mean. It's subtle. It's nothing major. Mm. It's subtle. But before we get into that. Yes. It was a good track. It was a very good track. It was my my favorite track. I still um, think the first track was my favorite, but this is my second favorite. Uh, production was great. The sample from the very first part of the because the three parts. The first part, the sample. I'm pretty sure a tribe called Quest have used that. Uh, maybe Cypress Hills, but I know I know that 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 beat's been sampled. Uh, J Cole samples it as well on a track, but a very famous sample, and you do it really just. I do think though that when you're rapping over it. You take the horns away a fair bit, and then you kind of let the the backing the backing sort of choir do a lot of work. I think you need to let those horns shine more because I feel like your vocals were a bit loud, too loud over that production. That's just how I feel from a production perspective, but still really enjoyable. The two switch ups are great from the radio to the to the air horns. Yeah, real dope. I like like you said, there were some flow switch ups. The flow switch up, especially on the third the third ending beat, was really fucking dope. But your tone doesn't really shift that much and that's my problem with you so with that being said i feel like if you want to keep listeners more engaged and push yourself creatively then change your tone experiment go some different high low Mm. moderate frequency tonalities and see how that goes for you but i think you're already on the right path of being able to make a very creative track if you did a whole album like this it would be a good album um, but obviously, it's three tracks from the album, so sounds like it's pretty pretty decent. Yeah, you found yourself some really good producers that you work well with. Like your vocals sound really good with this type of music. I fuck heavy with all the production that I heard. Pause. I don't get it. Why are you? Please, why please you continue? Te- why are you telling me to pause? I'm not telling you to pause. I'm just saying pause. You're a motherfucker, bro. Am I a motherfucker? <laughs> yeah, you fuck moms. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> shit. But yeah, if I have to say one thing to you, that's exactly what it is. Just some tone shifts. Maybe even practicing, man. Like there's a lot of YouTube videos and just like to teach you and stuff. Like even if you're aware, I'm not saying this is something you've got to do. If you're happy the way you're doing shit, but I'm just, I'm just saying that to make, your, to make it more different tone shifts, man. 
even like trying like like you'll see on on the second track like it sounded nice more Stuff like that more of that man that that's the only thing i'd want more from you other than that it's sounding dope man you're one of the best unknown artists we've had in a while that we fuck with and yeah, keep doing For your real. thing. This is dope, man. This yes. is dope. You got you got some cool shit. It was a pleasure to review your music. If Coming. any, keep them coming. If you want us to review, you just stay on and we'll review some more next month. Otherwise, if you guys want us to review your music, just email junglebeastmedia at gmail.com or hit the link, description, Patreon. Exactly. Um, yeah, thank you very much again. This is a pleasure. A lot of fun to review. We jungle beats. We fuck chickens. Goodbye. Sorry? <laughs> so what, what do we do? <laughs> we fuck chickens, bro. Rock a bat, 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 bat,